approximately 5,000 years ago, a population exploded out of Russia and replaced 90% of the male population of Western Europe in just 500 years. But here's what nobody's talking about. This happened at the exact date the Bible says the Tower of Babel occurred. And your DNA reveals which side of that divide your ancestors were on. I'm about to show you something geneticists have been documenting for the last decade, but nobody's connecting to ancient texts. By the end of this video, you'll understand why the Tower of Babel wasn't about pride, it was about power, how two populations dispersed at the same exact moment in opposite patterns, why your genetics predict which type of religion your ancestors developed, and what Genesis means when it says, let us go down, plural, not singular. This isn't speculation. This is peer-reviewed genetics confirming what ancient texts describe. Let's start with what we know for certain. Around 3300 BCE, that's 5300 years ago, a culture called the Yamnaya appeared suddenly on the grasslands between the Black Sea and the Caspian Sea. Not gradually, suddenly, with bronze metallurgy, domesticated horses, wheeled vehicles, and an organized society all appearing at once in an archaeological record. When scientists extracted DNA from the burial sites, they found unique genetic markers, haplogroups R1a and R1b. Remember those letters. Then, around 3000 BC, just 300 years after they appeared, something triggered a massive dispersal. One group carrying R1b moved west into Europe. By 2500 BCE, they had reached Britain, and when they arrived, 90% of the male population was replaced in just 500 years. Meanwhile, a second group carrying R1a moved east. They passed through the steppes and by 1500 BCE arrived in India, calling themselves Aryans. And here's the kicker. When geneticists tested India's caste system, they found the Brahmin priestly class had 14 times more R1a genetics than the indigenous population. A genetic advantage preserved 3,500 years through rigid social hierarchy. Now here's the question. 